friends i welcome all of you now we'll learn how we can change the default color schema and font size of putty or super putty in gns3 as you can see that this is a router i'll right click and click on the console you'll notice that uh, it'll take you to this color okay green as a foreground and black as a background so how we will change it uh, for the default that is once and for all now see you have to make these changes by default they would be skin 4 you have to replace it with skin 3 in case skin 4 is not mentioned you can simply copy this thing superparty.exe this command alright complete command from here I will mention this thing in my YouTube video you have to go into this uh, edit preferences console applications first of all this thing has to be selected uh, you have to type in this thing here okay superparty.exe talent this actually uh, skin 4 is by default let's make it 4 and see what happens by uh, because I have changed it to skin 3 you can see that okay skin 3 is by default and you can use these options skin 0 1 2 3 4 5 as per your wish and only these are available you cannot go beyond it so in case I want to change it to uh, this one black on white I'll make it skin 1 and click on the apply and click OK and then we'll close the session and see what happens next it will take a while okay here it is you can see that this uh, this color schema has changed once and for all and you can note down these things skin 0 is for very light gray against dark background similarly for skin 2 skin uh, 3 4 5 and you note this thing anything above skin 5 will have same effect as skin 0 and this thing you have to note down I'll mention this thing in my YouTube uh, summary section so that you can copy easily now next question is how will I increase the size of this font or you can say font size or how I can make this uh, further changes that I'll explain that to you and these changes will be forever you have to open this thing click on the tool section click on the putty configuration it will open up this window you have to actually this is the default setting you have to click over this and load by default it is loaded now go into the appearance section this option actually was not checked before so I have selected it so that cursor blinks click on this change click on this uh, font size in case you want to change it you can make it bold and you can pick any color of your choice uh, I mean any font style of your choice I'm gonna pick this Harvey balls and click on OK okay and after that in case I want to change colors I can do it I can choose this color uh, as per my choice it's your as well so once it is done actually once you click OK okay once you cancel it or and do anything it will not save the configuration forever so you have to go into session click over this and click over save this thing is must else your changes will not be saved next time you open putty and then click cancel and now I'll click uh, cancel and try to see what happens okay the font has changed probably we have pick the wrong one let's change it back to the one that is most most suited for us I'll change it to courier new and see what happens okay I would have to click on session and click over here and click over save if I don't save on this default setting then you will have trouble or probably uh, you have to make changes every time so let's write wow you see that now the font size has changed and it looks much better in case you want to teach anyone online then you can choose this color color as well as font and let me show that to you if it has changed once and for all or not
I'm gonna click over this click over GNS3 it will take a while to start GNS3 sometimes GNS3 has issues so you can click or cancel go to start task manager search for the GNS3 process there would be two sessions you have to click and process for both it happens more frequently now click on GNS3 it will start very quickly click over local server don't click anything I'm simply going to pick one router and show that uh, show that it has taken those changes okay I would have to start it first you'll see that it is okay for, wow that's what we wanted we wanted to have new font size and font uh, color you know so it is permanent now you do not have to make changes every time you switch on your GNS3 or party session so friends uh, once more click over tool party configuration uh, click over this click over load in fact if you even if you don't load then it's okay but if you have multiple sessions in that case you have to click over this default setting and then appearances change uh, the full uh, font and choose the options as you want and there are further things as well you can click over underline okay vertical lines and many more things you can choose all the options that you want and once it is done you have to click back on session click over default setting click over save and then cancel it then you have to start the new one so this is the way to change the default font size of super putty or putty sessions so friends I hope that it's been informative to you I would like to thank you for viewing have a nice day